Stop the it. men that I know and been around, they want women to pay them. I'm cooking right now. Let me cook. Sister, Let me cook. Sister, sister, I'm whipping sister. it up. Cook, clean, do everything y'all want us to do. Y'all handling y'all business, which I really cheating. Yeah. They done started yeah. beating you up, calling you out no. your name, can't pay the bill. The Bible said the wicked woman will be with a wicked man. Mm. And the reason why she said that is because she has never met a godly man in her life. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Mm. I cook. I let you cook. I let you cook. I let you cook. Drop that old man like a give and go. The one in the mirror is my biggest fall. Ain't gonna act like it's difficult. I gotta get right cause the time ain't gonna slow. Gotta do as it is written though. Man, I thank the Lord if you didn't know. All right, shalom, shalom, most high Christ bless. Shalom, though, what's up, though? This is Signs of the Time, 88.1 Radio, Power Talk Radio. I'm your host, Samson T. Judah. Officer Azaziah, some call me Big Red, from IUIC Detroit, Israel United in Christ. You got Officer Aaron, Israel United in Christ. Today you get the unadulterated truth according to the Bible. Officer Urian. Okay. Yeah, yeah, short, yeah. Short, so we got a lovely show today for you. And today's episode is going to be on black relationships, black love. Black, I'm trying to sound like, uh, uh, what's my man's name? Key Sweat. Put my Key Sweat voice on. Black love. Yeah, you got you to gotta whisper. For all you, for all you beautiful black people out there who love black unity we got a special show here for you today brought to you by iuic and original royalty records the music you just heard was brought to you by original royalty records and we are signs of the time brought to, sponsored by iuic so uh today we have some lovely ladies here today you know what i'm saying all oh, praises to the most high well uh to my right uh could you just let the people know what your name is and what you're about? Islam. Assalamu alaikum. This is Sister Amexum Cook Bay. Sister Amexum Cook Bay. Chief Divine Minister. The Chief Divine Minister. From the Queen Hour. From the Queen Hour. Because we're going to turn up and pull up and pull up and turn up. <laughs> all praise. All praise <laughs> to the Most High. And to her right is? Tradina, Chef Bless. I am a chef. I have my own catering service. What's the name of your catering service? Um, Black Blessed um, Catering Service. Black Blessed Black Catering, catering Service. Business. Okay, okay. And then to her right? Calvina Weems. I am the owner of Royalty Tech Services. Royalty Tech Service. Yes. Okay, okay. So we want to get the perspective from our black sisters. You know what I'm saying? From our, from our mothers, from our daughters, from our Why? How do you sisters feel... The state of black relationships is in this current world that we in now. Ooh, it sucks. Yes. Mm. It's not good at all. No truth. No. Loyalty, it, nothing. Like, it ain't good. Terrible. It's kind of strange. I don't. They said not to bring up the, <laughs> the, the what's the name again. Oh lord. Hmm. Who said that? One? <laughs> what's the what's the name? Bring it up. The flip flop. Oh, yeah. okay, oh, okay. People uh, not coming into relationships with right. good intentions. How about that? Right. So you said people not coming into relationships with good, good intentions. intentions. They right. lead you on to a certain extent already with an agenda. They coming in with their own agenda, and you it's taking what they 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 they, they not coming in with their own true colors. They true colors shows after what three to six months, maybe sometimes six months yeah. to a year. Hmm. So yeah. why do y'all think? Black relationships are failing because back in the 60s, you know, say when you look at uh, back when we was fl fighting for our civil rights, when we was being oppressed, it be it seemed to be like it was more tight knit families. Like we was getting married. Now, the mm -hmm. one first off, I want to ask: Are you sisters married? No, no, I've been married twice. I think it's due to drugs and alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. And then once they go to them prisons, that you don't know what you getting when they come, come out. Get out. So, <laughs> so is the fact that things are not good the in same. black relationships? Really Whose fault is it? Mm, I say both parties. You say 
Say what? Both, both parties. parties. Both parties. And, and, and people got to take accountability. Elaborate. Like, yes, Elaborate really, on that. Yes, really. I say women come in with their own agenda and men do too. But women are looking for a, a, a certain thing and men is too. Mm. But you never know what a person looking for after, like I say, three to six months, sometimes six to 12. Now you said you don't agree with that. You don't think it's both parties. What What? what, what do you think? Because women, we more like loyal. Like mm. men, y'all just be... Oof. Women are more loyal. Yes. We're gonna dive deep into it. Yes. Okay, okay, yeah. okay, we want to. We yeah. definitely go dive well, deep. Okay, into I like. Uh, okay, why do you believe women are more loyal, mm -hmm. loyal than men? You. gotta give the sense on that on. no seriously we are i feel like we are like we, we, we are when we love very. we love hard we love but hard. i feel like that's anybody oh. but anyway why do you why do you think that why do you feel like that we way? sit at home like cook clean do everything y'all want us to do but y'all really outside saying that y'all making money y'all handling your business but y'all really cheating Mm. Right, cheating because mm. guess true. what? Women go to the Oakland County Health Department. <laughs> they go, they take care of themselves. They go see what's wrong with their body. Men don't, uh, right? Mm. Mm. Okay, 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 okay. We had a good state here. We had a good right. state. So that's why it's important for us to have this conversation to see what's on the mind of our sisters. Now, I want to see the perspective from. Not just men, but godly men. You know yes. what I'm saying? We hold ourselves to the standards of the Bible. That's something I didn't ask y'all before we get to the brothers. Uh, do y'all believe in the Bible? Yes, I do. Yes. 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 Uh, yes, the Holy Bible. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Okay, yes. Okay, I'll praise it. I'll praise it. So, we dealing with men of the Bible. So, the Bible, there's something different. Yeah, yeah, the Holy Bible. Okay, yeah, the, Holy the Holy Bible. Bible. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. So, the, the Old Testament. There you go. Okay, okay. And the Sermon okay. on the Mount. Right. Okay, I'll that praise one. it to the most. I'll pray. So, we want to hear the same question. Uh -huh. So, the state of black relationships today. What, how do you feel about the state of black relationships? The state, now nah, I do want to preface what I'm about to say with this. We are not the Christian church. The brothers that you see in purple, because I heard my sister over here, what was your name again in the pink? Tradina. Tradina said mm -hmm. the Tradina. godly men be the worst ones. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the reason why she yeah, said yeah. that is because she has never met a godly man in her life. Mm -hmm. Because there's no man in her life. Mm -hmm. Because there's no godly men in the Christian church. Damn. Oh, oh, now, oh, oh, oh. give me Hosea chapter 4 oh. and verse 1. Mm -hmm. Whoa. The men in the Christian church. One. Mm -hmm. Whoa. The men in the Christian church do not hold themselves accountable to the word of God. They skew the word of God. They don't keep it. They don't care about it. And they don't love it. And that's why they don't apply it when it comes to marriage. Mm. But the Israelites are here to tell you exactly how it should be done. Mm. Thus saith the Lord. Mm. Read okay. what you got. This is Hosea chapter 4 verse 1. Mm -hmm. Hear the word of the Lord. So now we must hear the word of the Lord. Read. Ye children of Israel. The children of Israel are the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. You sisters will be called the Israelites today. Read on. For the Lord had a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. So the Lord has an issue with the inhabitants of the land. That's us. What issue does God have with us? Read. Because there is no mer there is no truth. There's no what? No truth. Now the sister just said that and she didn't know she was prophesying. Mm. The Bible says there is no truth. Meaning what? The laws of God are not kept in this land. Mm. That's why you see so much of what God is about to say. Read. Nor mercy. There's no mercy. There's no mercy from the black man to the black woman. Mm -hmm. There's no mercy from the black woman to the black man. Mm -hmm. And that's why relationships suck. Mm. That's why you see so much <laughs> issue today. Mm. Read. Nor yeah. knowledge of God in the land. You might think there's knowledge of God, but there really is none. That's mm. why the pastors are sleeping with their congregants. Mm. <laughs> that's why they still give out tithes, even though that's right. not supposed to be money. Mm. That's supposed mm. to be food. Mm. That's the first time y'all heard that today. Now, oh, what else is in the Christian church? There's no... Why is it, why aren't the pastors teaching about marriage, about unity, about equity? No, they don't teach that. They say, "Come as you are." That's mm -hmm. not what the Bible says. Read by swearing and lying and lying and killing and killing and stealing. You ever heard of black on black crime? This is what the Bible's talking mm -hmm. about. And stealing. You got a uh, uh, stick up boys, yeah. B and E's. Read and committing adultery and what and committing adultery and what. 
committing adultery. Be the men commit adultery against the women. The women commit adultery against the men. You have you see it everywhere. The sisters believe that uh, the sisters are more loyal though. Well, well, well maybe we are. are. We don't loyal. know about everybody else. So oh, okay, okay. <laughs> maybe that's what oh, okay, it is, okay. brother man. So, <laughs> so check it, check it, right? You're on here. Mm -hmm. Um, our sisters are more loyal. Now I'm not gonna argue about the loyalty, but just have raise your hand if you ever seen Maury. Okay. Oh, Hold on, wait a minute. I've seen more. You see more? I see. I want to talk. I just 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 want to talk. Let him cook. Let him cook. I just want to say something. Let him cook. That happened to me in real life. I just want to say something. Uh, oh, say something. Y'all, whoever heard of the saying, "Mama's baby, daddy's maybe." I mean, brother. We ever heard these sayings? That happened to me. Now these sayings. She lived it. Now listen, these sayings don't come from out of nowhere. I want to make I want to make sure y'all understand these sayings don't come from out of nowhere, and these these men that's not loyal. There's always a woman that he's not loyal with. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So what I'm trying to say is it is a two way street. Mm -hmm. Now mind you, it does go both ways, mm -hmm. but but Talk to him, G. there's more to it. How many y'all know how marriage even works, right? According to the Bible, all right. So let's say this: a man cheats on a woman, right? Uh -huh. What does the Bible say? about that if a man cheat on a woman what must what can the woman do in that situation according to the bible the man then probably already treated he didn't already <laughs> cheated probably treated somebody or something because i'm take just the thought no but what is she supposed the to do the thought is you cheat if you think what, about another woman in a, in a in the in the right you're supposed to what? stick it out it's supposed to be right. fixed on worked on yeah. talked about but yeah. it shouldn't keep on continuing okay right. Boom. right i like that now what if the woman cheat according to the bible the it's safe, but men mean? runs. No, no, he what is, he said what? it's supposed to be the same? Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. They, they don't need to be together. Oh. They're equal. They right. shouldn't be together if they can't be faithful. I'm with you. Don't <laughs> be with that person. Now look, person. now look, now look. I hear what y'all saying. <laughs> I said a past can happen. I hear what you said. What's your name, sis? Calvina. 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 Tradina. Sister Maxim. Sister Maxim. I thought but she was right. having sex with Ina. unless she married anyway. <laughs> That's <laughs> right. <laughs> That's right. But we talking about cheating though, right? right. We talking about so we cheating. Talking about we talking about married couples. We're talking about married couples cheating. So, right. so, right. so when a, when, right. when, right. Right. You, you better go down. We talking about marriage though. We talking about marriage. Mm. So not so not listen to this. So not listen to this. Because one of the things is we married, right? All three of us, we we married men. Right? I've been married for 13 years. He's been married for seven, eight years. We all married. Right. So, got kids and everything. we got kids and everything. So, the thing is, what we trying to, what I'm trying to, the point I'm trying to make is the gravity between a man cheating and a woman cheating. It is a difference. I want to make that clear. I will, and I'm going to show it to you in the Bible. But let's read that real quick because it's a difference. A man cheat and a woman cheat in the Bible. It's a difference because you said if a man cheat, he got to. Uh, the woman got to stay and work it out. Yeah. If a woman cheat, a man should stay and work it out. Yes. Okay, let's see what the Bible says. No, that ain't what I think. They need to go about their business. <laughs> okay, they let's see what the Bible ways. say about that. And I'm going I'm to read this to you, just so you know. Go ahead. Romans chapter 7, verse 2. For the woman which hath an husband is bound by law to her husband, so long as he liveth. Read that again. For the woman which hath an husband is bound by law to her husband mm -hmm. as long as he liveth. So as long as that husband is alive, you are bound. You got. You must stick that thing out, right? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Now, we're not telling you to kill him and speed up the process. That ain't what we're saying. We're not saying yeah, no kill him. Rat poison in Don't food. rat poison him. Okay. Right? Uh, now, now what about the man? No now what about the man? Let's go to, uh, what's that, Matthew? You gotta finish it. Oh, let's finish it out. Go ahead. Finish it out. But if the husband be dead, she is loosed from the law of her husband. Boom. Now, if he die, you're free to remarry yeah, or do what you got to do. Not, but that didn't say it. That, what did that just say? Right. Ain't no divorce until he dies, right? Reverse, right? reverse three. That's her, that's her question. Reverse three. Go ahead. Reverse three. Go ahead. Reverse three. Oh. So, then, so then if, while her husband liveth, she be married to another man, she shall be called an adulteress. Mm, but if her, Go ahead. But if her husband be dead, she is free from that law. So if you get divorce him while he's still alive and you go get married, 
you are committing adultery, according to the Bible. Wow. A lot of wow. us didn't know that. Y'all didn't know that. That's did a good point. That's a good point. I, 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 that's a good point. I, I got a question for the sisters, right? Come on, come on, come on. I got a question. I got a question, right? I, I, so wait, I, I got a question. Married, so you telling me? Hold on, hold on. Let me ask you a question. Wait, wait, Give me one second. Wait, 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 you saying I can't get married again because I've been divorced twice? I'm committing adultery. Yeah, that's because some people is alive. Sister, that's a I was sitting there and being lonely. That's the first time. That's the first time I heard that, right? That's what you're telling me. Nah, we're not saying, nah, we're not saying, we're not saying, be miserable and be alone. You ain't subscribed yet? Look at this guy, man. You ain't right, man. Get the press the button. Press the button. I got a question for y'all, sister. I want you to listen to this, right? So, since the topic of marriage was brought up, so this is the question. Is it important for us to get married now? In the black community, <clears throat> or should we not be getting them married? Because I heard somebody say you're not supposed to have sex until you marry. I think they should get married. Yeah, I think I, you should I get married. Like what do y'all feel about sex before marriage? What do y'all well, feel about that? We, you shouldn't have we, sex. No, we be sinning before our, marriage. You don't supposed to, but we gonna do we it anyway. Shouldn't. Mm. So if we do have sex like before, we keeping it real, right? Right, we've keeping it real, yeah, right? It real. So if do we anyway. do have sex before marriage, what should we do? That's a good question. I don't know. I, don't know. I, I made an attempt to get uh, baptized, <laughs> repent, and do some other things and went into celibacy and abstinence. Mm. Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. What about you? What you right. think? Right. What do you think? Because I want to hear from each one of y'all one by one. Um, Ina. Wow. <laughs> sex before marriage. If we have sex before marriage, I mean, we should sit down and have a conversation if that's going to be the long term. Nine though. times out of ten, these men ain't trying to marry you. So one at a time. One at a time. One at a time. But, but, but we're we going to hear from each he person. Before, but you before I want to fool your, your full thought. Anybody, no, not just, just er, <coughs> every day living. Oh, shoot. I have no comment. <laughs> that's a good question. So, okay. So, no we okay, know that sex before marriage is happening, right? For sure. Well, every day. Right right y'all yeah. yeah. said y'all believe in the Bible, right? What should we be doing if that happens? Should not be we shouldn't be having sex, period. Mm. Okay, okay, so okay, okay. So, 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 me in, coach. Weird. So, okay, I, so I got so a question for the brothers. I okay, agree. so, so me in. No sex, sex before marriage. You're sex before marriage. Let's see what the Bible says. Because we must have a standard in the black community. What I've noticed is the Chinese men, they have standards. Arabs have standards. That's true. Uh, Japanese people have standards. Mm -hmm. The only people that I see don't have standards is my mm. people, the black race. Uh, no, no. So now I got standards, but so you might have it. But a as a whole, as no, a nation, hold on, wait, wait, as a whole, let me, speak, let, me speak, let me cook, let me cook, sisters, let me cook. I'm cooking right now. Let me cook. Sisters, let me cook. Sisters, sisters, I'm whipping sisters. it up. We we do everything like decently in order, right? Sisters, I want you to pay attention. What's your name? What's your name again? Oh. Calvina. Calvina. Sister Calvina. So the question we asked y'all the question. We want to hear the yeah, thoughts from the brothers. Now. So now, so go ahead. Same was, question. What I was saying was, we lack a standard as a race. Mm -hmm. We might have individual standards, but as a collective, there are none. So now, read Exodus twenty-two and sixteen. Mm -hmm. We used to have standards as a people before we were put in slaves and shackles. We had standards, and we're about to read them. Read that. Exodus chapter 22, verse 16. Come on. And if a man entice a maid. Now, if a man come and spit game, let's say Calvina, right? A man come and spit game in Calvina. Say, what's up, shorty? You know, blah, 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 blah. Is this your ride? I said, yeah, you want to go for a ride with me? She said, no, I want to drive it. I see. <laughs> Can you drive stick? Read. That is not patrol. She's not married. She's single. Go ahead. And lie with her. And they... Slamming the yams. They have sex, you know, just keep it hunted. They have sex. Read. He shall surely endow her to be his wife. Marry me. Marry me. Really? Really. Marry me. What? Yes. What must he do? He shall surely endow her to be his wife. He has to marry her. That's what the Bible says. That's why there's not supposed to be uh uh, sex before marriage because God looks at it far more serious than we look at it. Mm. The oh, Bible yeah. says you must get married That's right. when you have sex. Right after, you got to have the covenants and papers and sign them. This is now my wife. This is now my husband. Mm. Read mm. Exodus, I mean, read Hebrews 13 and 4. Y'all heard that Facebook? 
That's what mm. must be done. That's why that, with that one law, there would be no baby mamas. Mm. There would be no women complaining right. about you knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> there would be no STDs because right. promiscuity would be finished yeah, yeah, yeah. just with one law being kept. Watch that. That's crazy. Read. Hebrews chapter 13 verse 4. Come on. Marriage is honorable in all. What did God say? Marriage is honorable in all. God esteems, honorable means esteemed very highly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. God esteems marriage very highly. The problem is his people do not. The black, Hispanic, and Native American man do not esteem marriage very highly. Mm. We don't care about marriage. That's why there's that's why I'll hit y'all with a statistic. Eighty percent of marriages today, the first person to divorce is mm. who y'all think it's it is. It's the woman. It's the woman. Y'all already y'all already knew that statistic. Right. They give up. Read on. Marriage is honorable and all, and the bad and the foul. Mm -hmm. But whoremongers a whoremong that's a call a whore another name for a whoremonger is a boyfriend. Read? And adulterers. Another name for adulterers or adulteresses is is a girlfriend or a side piece or a a, a, a hot thotty. What, what, what else do they say? A lot of them. You know, all a boo thing. You know what I'm saying? Read. But whoremongers and adulterers, God will judge. How does God judge whoremongers and adulterers? That's the question on the table. Here we go. Deuteronomy 28, 61. How mm -hmm. does God judge a whoremonger or an adulterer? Then does I got he, a question for the sisters the, after this. Yes, sir. Does he hit you with a belt? Does he, does he slap you in the back of your head like your mama used to do? How does God judge a whoremonger or an adulterer? Read mm -hmm. it. Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 61. Come on. Also, every sickness mm. and every plague. Every sickness and every plague. Read. Which is not written in the book of this law. Here's the question. Can you find chlamydia in the Bible? Mm -mm. Can you find the clap mm -mm. in the Bible? Mm -mm. Can you find AIDS? What about the monster? Mm -mm. What about crabs? Mm -mm. Boo waffle. Mm -hmm. You know them all. <laughs> Can you find these things in no. the Bible? No. no. But wow. God just said what? Read it again. Also, every sickness and every plague, mm -hmm. which is not written in the book of this law. Shall what? Them will the Lord bring upon thee. So when you're a whoremonger and an adulterer, you wonder why you, you got to go to you got to go to the doctor and mm -hmm. get that syphilis shot. Mm -hmm. You wonder why you got to go remove <laughs> right. that clap from out your system. Mm -hmm. Right. Or you got to be celibate for three months because you got hit with something. <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. Because you're an adulterer or an adulteress or a whoremonger. So I got I got that was a good point right there. That was a good point. I got a question for my sisters, right? So first, before I get to the question, I will do start with uh, the high priestess. Did I say it right? I'm not no priestess. Or she's, the, the, she's the divine. The divine minister. I'm divine sorry. Minister. I'm sorry. Divine Let me get it right. The, 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 I'm indigenous. The chief. <laughs> divine minister. Divine minister. I'm indigenous. Uh, the Moore Science Temple. Yeah, the chief. question is, yeah. did you agree with the brothers just said, first off? Of course I agree with anything that's holy and divine. Mm -hmm. Oh, praise. Right. So what, about, what about you? Yes, I do. You, okay. I do. So, okay. So now, we real though. We gotta be real. So he he told us we how what we supposed to be doing. We gotta be real, right? Mm -hmm. When we look in the black community, we not. Y'all keep saying single. black. It's the, all races doing the same thing. I'm with it. you, right, but no, only no. person we care about is the, the black see. Hispanic yeah, because it right. started with us at home right. first. We gotta fix our own problems mm -hmm. first. Right. When we look at our community, I'm more. You know, I don't call myself. Negro, black, color, okay, the African so called black American, community, right? So, so, right? so called black. Let me get to the question. Right, the, the question. so called black. Yeah, so, the go, so called black community, right? Right. Is marriage being honored, right? And if not, why is that? No, it's not. I, I want to hear, we're going to go down the line. I know it was with my parents and my grandparents, but mm. it seemed like when my time came along, it was like, uh uh. It's mm. like somebody dropped the ball and That's I'm right. still. Trying to keep it together. Mm. You okay. know, I'm going into a maturity and I'm like, uh uh, something not right. Mm -hmm. So I figured I just stay to myself. If it, if God, the great God of the universe, sent me a, uh, a great God, well, hey, something in the image of likeness, I'm going to be okay. Okay. Mm. I'm going to wait on it because something ain't right. Okay, okay. So I like that. We'll come back to that point after I'm uh, here from the system. So what do you think? No. The because system. these men is just like it's these men they looking at faces bodies mm. they they don't care about marriage they all they think about is the hype mm. they I'm it's sure so many women that's coming that way and nowadays women is like no, see, coming after the men one time, literally one time. like men not approaching women for real mm -hmm. the women is approaching these men mm. so these I can let me say this Good. women. 
Nowadays, talk it's just these 2,000 kids. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. The men, I'm going to like, the 2,000. So you would say the reason is because men are stepping to the plate and being men? No, they're not being men. Okay, okay. That's your honest opinion. Okay, what what, what you think? Um, No, but um, I, I feel like men run away from the conversation of marriage. Women is placing the conversation of marriage in the front of a man. Mm. They they act like they don't know what if if it's even capable of doing. And the first thing they say is, "Oh, I don't want to get married because my mama and say, oh baby, it it was different back in those days." Mm. People stuck it out. They fixed their relationships yes. and so on and so on. They want to run off and go ahead and get Keisha Kent. Kim and Karen, babies, and come back. Right. Hell yeah, no. All right, so I got a question, right? Because it's good. It's good. It's good stuff, right? I wait, like wait it. Wait a minute. I'm going to start with you. The, We're going back down the line. I, I got my question. The men that I know and been around, they want women to pay them. Mm, mm. They done so, the so, oh, oh, damn. 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 Okay, okay. So look, look. So we realistic here on right. size of the time. Wait, wait, right? We supposed to, they supposed to be on provide, on. protect, Come on. Come on. process, Come on. support, Come on. Mm. and whatever else I can mm. think of. No because I'm going to do it back to them. Okay. To okay. the 100 power. Okay. To, if it go even That's higher right. than that. Because I go 360 degrees and can go higher. So, so okay. this, is, this is my but question. But they ain't going to act right. Right. I'm mm. not going to waste my time. Mm. I had a man cuss me out <laughs> just because I said I happened? wanted to be around millionaires and billionaires. Before I knew it, I was everything under the sun. It was like you missing the point. Yeah, you got right. to have a right. for you. You missing the point. You talking about Lead a nation, it takes finance. Okay. You got okay. to you got to come up with some finance. You can't what you gonna just what you gonna do? All right, listen to this. So so, so this is my question, right? Because yeah. <laughs> we realistic here and we right. understand that in today's society, and with these signs of the time, there are a lot of weak men, right? right. But <laughs> do you sisters do you sisters believe all men are the same? No, <clears throat> no, no. But they no. are in a, in their own little way sometimes. Yes. But we talking about the negative because we understand it's weak men that don't take care of their women. Yeah. They, they they don't take they not That's stepping up. Question. They not stepping up to the society, right? They not stepping up to their providing. <laughs> but we got men here that's married, so that's not the case with all men, right? right. So my we, question we is, are all men the same? Yes, because I know a lot and, of men. And hold on, and yeah. you and. If that is the case, if that or if it's not the case, how do you f- prevent yourself from being Talk with that. a no good we nigga? We don't know. We're going to go down the line. I, I don't call people the N word. <laughs> we do here at Size of the Time. <laughs> if you are, if you act like a nigga, <laughs> you are nigga. we're going to ask, we're going to call you. A now, nigga. A nigga and a good man are two different things. Well, we're well, asking you how oh to prevent God. yourself. Okay, if you don't like the word nigga, how do you prevent okay, yourself I, I, from hooking I, I, up with a no good man? Uh... That's why I went into celibacy and abstinence. I don't Mm. right because they run. They run so much game, and if they (laughs) not six (laughs) foot two or taller, (laughs) fine as ever, paid and full, dark as night, I probably won't even pay attention to them because I know how they are. Mm. They they on some a whole nother level, a whole nother thought process. And I and look if it if they ain't talking about what I'm talking about, what's the use of it? That's good. That's good. 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 Okay. So this is the question. Okay. First off, are all Men the same, and second, the second question is, if not, how do you prevent yourself from hooking up with a no good man versus a good man? That's a hard question because um, married men do the same as single men. They live life like they single too. So I wouldn't know if I meet a no good man because take time. it take time, and they be they. It's, I don't. I wouldn't know. So that's a hard question. Okay, that's honest. That's honest. I like that answer. Okay. Um, what's the question? Okay, the question is, bam. No, that's your fault. Are all men the same? And no. then two. Okay, you say no. And if that's the case, how do you avoid hooking up with this bad man that y'all speaking of versus finding a good man? Uh, <clears throat> I feel like from experience, you know what you do and do not want to walk into. So if you sit down and have a logic conversation, he tells it on himself in at least 30 minutes. Yeah. You go, 
your conversation is key. So you can have a conversation and tell, oh, he ain't on the same path. He ain't trying to go this way. I, he looking straight. I'm trying to go left. You know what I'm saying? So you got to conversate with these people. You got to understand what they do and do not want out of life. So then if you know you that type of person that can give what he's looking for, then okay, continue on dating. You can see where life will take y'all. But if he's saying he's trying to, he want this and this and that, and you know you're not that type of person for that type of situation, walk away. But you, people stay in it because you want to know why? It's fun. It's exciting. He give me this feeling. Baby, that feeling going to last for two days. You don't mm. find that suspicious. That. Mm. So if you want to continue on that third day, that's nor his or my problem because he told you who he was. Okay, 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 okay. I right. like what I'm hearing. I like that. So we're going to go to the brothers. We're going to go down the line. All right, look. We're going gonna to start where you're at. So the question is, one, are all men the same? Mm -hmm. Two, if they not all the same, how do women avoid hooking up? Where we gonna go back to saying no good niggas? Right. How do we hook? How do we avoid hooking up no with the women? Avoid hooking up with no good way. Negroes. Right. Officer Yurian, what you got? <laughs> so, number one, we learn we learn our habits from our parents. Right. Mm. Right. Sister said earlier, back in my parents' day. It was like this, right. but you know what it is. I you see be free. We out here in the slums, in the ghettos. Like, like subscribe, comment, like share, all that good stuff. If you want to see more content like this? Subscribe. Uh, after a certain amount of time, what happened? It started to degenerate, right. right? So now our young sisters they can't go to the older sisters for true guidance mm -hmm. because the older sisters Stop don't got the guidance. Stop. So real quick, read that real quick in Ezekiel. I'm gonna just I'm gonna start here. Then we gonna we gonna let me land my plane. Come on. Ezekiel chapter 16 verse 44 come on behold everyone that uses use, useth proverbs shall use this proverb against thee yeah saying as is the mother so is her daughter what that say as is the mother so is her daughter so as is the mother so is the daughter nine times out of ten that young woman don't know how to get a husband because she didn't grow up in a house with a two parent where well, her, her her mother had a husband because we didn't know in the book of titus it talks about the older teaching the younger on how to be holy on how to be right but that was lost now what should they been teaching her give me that answer rock chapter six what should have the mother should have been teaching the younger daughters we're gonna see because nowadays i'm gonna be real you can't learn what type of man is after four hours. Okay. You take him out, he take you out, he get you some crap, we hey. slamming hams. Hey, that ain't how it works. Wham, bam, thank you, Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. You doing whole activities with whole tendencies. Ain't getting no husband like that. I'm going to tell you straight up. We we setting ourselves up for failure. You know what I'm saying? When you go, when you wake up and you looking, getting dressed and you look in the mirror and you do one of these right here. From the back. <laughs> from the back. <laughs> You doing one of them? What they do, what they do. You gonna get a dog. He gonna come <laughs> sniffing true. around go and then be gone. Go catch, but it's a cycle. Read that real quick. Watch. Sirach chapter six, Let's verse see what God seven. Saying. Come on. If thou wouldest get a friend. If you would get a friend, meaning a potential husband in your in this case, come on. Prove him first. What should you do? Prove him first. Proving means to try him. See who he is. Don't kiss him. Don't let him grab on you. Don't have sex with him. Don't do none of that. Don't do none of that because what we talked about earlier, no sex before marriage. Mm -hmm. But we don't apply these things. So when you have sex before marriage, he got but what he But some women, they're going to say, I waited uh, 90 days. I oh, gave him 90 days yeah. to wait. Yeah. Him 90 what, days. What, what about that? Okay, let's yeah, read. They say, they say he, they got 90 days to get the cookie. Oh, yeah, God. What, what about that? So you putting a timer, you putting oh, a timer right. on, your, on your crotch. Yeah, that's crazy. I don't believe that. Watch this. Read that. Read on. Read on. And be not hasty to credit him. What'd that say? And be not hasty to credit him. 90 days is not long enough to prove what a man is. What you what you seeing is the representative. Okay. You're seeing he's he's on his best behavior to get the cookie. He being his be on his best behavior. He telling you everything you want to hear. He like, girl, I'm gonna cook for you. Girl, we're gonna go to Benny Hanna. Girl, let me what you want. Da, 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 da. He gonna hold it up for as long as he can. But then you get past them 90 days, he's gonna be like, all right, she tripping, I'm out. Then you find out what he really was, right? I'm gonna I'm I'm show you something else. Go to Sirach real quick, but, but they, chapter 26, well, verse 23. They got it and you're in a relationship. <laughs> They done start yeah. beating you up, calling but, you out no. your name, can't pay the bills. Sister Divine Minister. Wait a minute. That's the point. This is the point. Right now. Sister, this is the point. 
You got to know how to prove the man. You got to know what to prove that. Give me uh, first round four one. You got to know what to prove him by. If you don't know the requirements of a godly man, how can you get a godly man? Because you got to remember, we're talking about the topic right now is before marriage. marriage. Like yes. finding this person. So we're going to get back into it's once you are married. Find, but but right now, marriage. the finding process. Exactly. We're we, we trying to find out how do I find a righteous man? Mm. Right? Read that. First John chapter four, verse one. Come on. Be loved. Believe not every spirit. Believe not every man. Because best believe a oh, man, no. a man yes. in this world, if he's not about God, he got an agenda. Right. And we all know the agenda. Mm -hmm. The agenda. Well, there you go. You know. But y'all know too. Yeah, yeah. But some of y'all, but y'all, it's like y'all equipping yourself for no, it to happen. It, I, like, I'm speaking in generalities. Uh, I'm speaking in generalities. No, but it's like once they in front we, of them or we, because I could put myself in the category too. That's real. We forget that it's only one agenda. They, they own this one agenda and we allow it to happen. See, and we do got to be honest. All we, that's they, called being I like what you just said. I just like what you said because you got to be honest, right? Yeah. All of us have made mistakes, right? Most if we're not yeah. married right now with no, the first yeah. person we ever had sex with, Somebody got the cookie. Yeah. It was something that he yeah. did that made you feel right. But then you found Man, out this, yeah, this yeah. Negro not what he told me he was. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You gotta be honest with yourself about yeah. that. Right. So we got in order to avoid that happening again, it's we gotta hard. be honest. How, how, right. So her question is how? How? Because I, I like that question that she had earlier. Yeah, she said, she said, I don't know. I don't have know. Sex with a person, they still like not even ready for marriage. Right. So, so uh, if she's right saying, she saying, as a woman, she I don't know, don't right? She don't know. Right. How do she find this person? Yeah. 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 What if you live uh, with the people? Sub me in. Sub me in. And you sub me in. Sub me in. What about the common law? We're gonna let we're gonna let your young finish. Come on, man. Scripture. Come on. Okay. First John four and one. Come on. But love, believe not every spirit. So, sister, believe not every spirit, right? We got y'all got to understand that we we're as men we are banking on on the thought of you believing us. We're banking on that. Read. But try the spirits whether they be of God. The scriptures say, try the spirits rather they be of God. How do you know if a spirit is of God? You don't know. You don't know, but you won't know unless you are of God. Unless. You are doing what's required, mm. unless you are the woman in these pages. Mm. That's yeah, how you, you prove it. it you must be taught. You gotta study your Bible. Gotta, you gotta study the scriptures to understand. Last scripture, that? real quick, Sirach chapter twenty-six, verse twenty-three. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna read this because this this plagues the black community. It is what it is. And remember, it's coming back around to y'all. So y'all gonna ask y'all questions, but yeah, we gonna on. let them finish there. So we come back. It's coming back. I know y'all know you want to say something. You gonna get your chance. But watch. Be we patient. wonder. You're, we you're wonder. As chance. sisters, we want y'all wonder why every man. You said every man is the same. Da, 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 da. Right? I didn't, I didn't say like uh, all like most men are the same. I say they most. All the same. The in same. Their own little way. Right. Okay. Yeah. So they mostly the same. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But so you gotta ask yourself, damn, why do I keep getting this same dude? You at this point, it's time to reflect. It's time to look inside. Cause right. watch this. Watch what the Bible say. Right. Sirach right. chapter twenty six verse twenty three. Because if a woman walk out in a damn blanket, not one guy's going to say but nothing to her. But if you walk out, women. if you walk out the crib, right. the booty popping, the breasts is out, cleavage is moving, everything is rocking. You showing the dog what he wants. What do you think you're going to attract? Watch this. Watch what the Bible say. Watch. Sirach chapter 26, verse 23. Come on. A wicked woman. A what? A wicked woman. A woman that doesn't follow the Bible. Is given as a portion to a wicked man. A wicked woman will be with a wicked man. That's what the Bible said. The Bible said... The wicked woman will be with a wicked man because if you got wicked ways, those wicked ways attract wicked niggas. So if they if like to smoke weed, they're gonna end up with a weed. They're gonna end up with a weed, nigga. Right. Watch, read. But a godly woman. But a what? A godly woman. But a what? A godly woman. But a godly woman is given to him that feareth the Lord. But a godly woman is gonna end up with a godly. You're gonna attract that man because he's gonna see the respect on you. You're gonna be like, dang, she carry herself different. Mm -hmm. I like that. Her conversation is different. Mm -hmm. She don't. She's not disrespectful. She says mm -hmm. thank you right. when brothers open the door. Mm -hmm. She doesn't expect things. She she moves like how the Bible says but to move. So that you man, nothing, that yeah. man Bring will attract. You will attract that man. Guarantee. Bring it up. Uh, we're gonna go to Big Red and then we're gonna hear from the sisters. Big it's Red. important. And then we're gonna go to the commercial. We gotta go commercial because we gotta. We
we don't plug original royalty. We in the building. So, Big Red, the same question. How do women avoid hooking up with no good Negroes and find a godly man? That's an excellent question. I like everything also Yurion said. Let's first go to Ciroc 724. Uh, the reason why we have such disastrous relationships today is because of what also Yurion said. There is no proving. Women don't know what to look for. I'll tell you exactly how it should be, and then I'll say why it happens. Good. Sirach chapter 7, verse 24. Read. Hast thou daughters? Is a man, do you have daughters? Because they all came from a man. Every single one of y'all came from a man, right? Read. Have a care of their body. A father is supposed to care for his daughter's body. He's supposed to be worried about who she's attracting. Mm -hmm. He's supposed to make, make sure she's not wearing the wrong things. She's not around the wrong people. Right. She's not uh, speaking or acting in a lewd manner. Read. And show not thyself cheerful toward them. Read. Marry thy daughter. Do what? Marry thy daughter. The Bible says, give away your daughter, fathers. Oh, you ready to give her away? <laughs> oh, praise <laughs> Read. And so shalt thou have performed a weighty matter. It's a weighty matter. Why? Read on. But give her to a man of understanding. The father is supposed to, because dads know what time it is. <laughs> when the dad has the daughter with the at the prom, he look, he takes the son aside and says, look, don't do nothing with my daughter crazy, because he knows what time it is. Who the fuck are you? I'm Mr. Burnett. I'm Reggie. What you doing here? Came to take home, Megan. How old are you? I'm 15, Mr. Burnett. Motherfucker, you look 30. Get your ass up against that wall. What the fuck your problem? You think you know it all? You little young thundercats. What you want, nigga? I'm here to take your new thought out. How old are you? 15. Shit, nigga, you at least 30. Now listen. Have my daughter home at 10.01. If she ain't home at 10.01, I'm in the car, okay? Lock loaded and hunting your motherfucking ass down. You a virgin? Yes. All right, keep it that way. Ain't gonna be no fucking that night. He was a young man himself, but a father supposed to give the daughter to a man of understanding. So the problem, so you're saying the problem is that the father's not picking the man for the women out there? Yes. Mm. The father, give me that in Deuteronomy where it says, prostitute not thy daughter. That's a good question. Uh, and also, the sister had a good question. A I, she said, what if, we? I want you to answer that first. What then if you don't have a father? What if you don't have give a father? Give me Sirach 4 and 10. Excellent question. We know the Bible, we study and pray and we prophesy every day. So, Sirach chapter 4 and verse 10. This is why. This is what happens. Let's say you don't have a father. There's supposed to be a place where you can go to where fathers are present, and I'll explain what I mean. First, we're gonna go to Sirach. Then we're gonna First Timothy five and eight. Go ahead. Sirach chapter four, verse ten. Read. Be as a father unto the fatherless. The Bible commands men of God to be a father to the fatherless. Be a father to the women that don't have fathers. Be a father to the young men that didn't be raised with fathers. Read. And instead of an husband and unto their mother. Don't try to get into their pants. Mm -hmm. Instead of a husband to their mom, be a father. Mm -hmm. Be a leader. Mm -hmm. Lead these women properly. If they don't have a dad, you're supposed to come to them with the word of God and say, Look, sister, you're acting in this manner. Don't give yourself up to this man. He's not a man of understanding. The, mm -hmm. the, the brothers in your community that keep God's commandments are your fathers. But some women be vulnerable, though. You're right. That's why they have to get counsel with the men of the Lord. Not the ones in the church. I'm not talking about them. Yeah. With the real men of the Lord. No, what type of men of the Lord? <clears throat> the men of the Lord are those that keep God's commandments. The ones you see in purple right now, that's the ones that are yeah. the men of the Lord. Mm. The ones that prophesy and teach the Bible and apply it to their lives every day. Read that. So shalt thou be as a son of the Most High. So shalt you be a son of... That's talking about the leader will be a son of God when he treats the people properly, when he's a father to the fatherless. Mm -hmm. Now go to 1 Timothy chapter 5, and we're going to talk about uh, where are the fathers? How do you find them? What do they look like? 1 Timothy chapter 5, verse 1. Yes. Rebuke not an elder. Watch this. But entreat him as a father. Entreat him as a what? As a father. As a what? As a father. That's where your fathers are. Mm -hmm. We have a school, 20118 Schoolcraft Road. We have elders over us. They are our fathers. We entreat them as our fathers. We get counsel from them. We talk to them. The women come to us. They ask us, what do you think about this man? Should I marry him? Because you have to understand, it's a weighty matter when a woman gets married versus when a man gets married. Did y'all know that? I'm going to show you. Numbers chapter 30. 
Numbers chapter 30. I then after this, we're going to play, go to a commercial for music, and we're going to hear back from the sisters. Yes, I bet y'all have never heard this ever in your lives. Because when I first came into the truth, this is when I heard it. I never heard it in the church. Watch this. Numbers chapter 30. Numbers chapter 30, verse 3. Mm -hmm. If a woman also vow a vow unto the Lord. So now you guys pray to the Lord, correct? Yes. yes. So if a woman vows a vow to the Lord, she prays to the Lord. Lord God, help me buy this car. Lord God, help me find a good man. Read. And bind herself by a bond. She says, Lord, I'm going to do this and this and be this. Read. Mm -hmm. Being in her father's house she's in her in youth. Her, she's in her father's house as a young woman. Come on. And her father hear her vow. Her father hears what she says. And what? And her bond wherewith she bound her soul. He heard her prayer that she prayed to God. Read. And her father shall hold his peace and, in her. And her father doesn't say anything. Meaning, he agrees with what she just said. He heard her prayer. He's like, okay, that's cool. I like that. He keeps going. Read. Then all her vows shall stand. Then her vows shall stand. Watch yeah. this. Read. And every bond wherewith she had bound her soul shall come, stand. Come on. But if her father disallow her in the day that he heareth her. If her father says, Lord, don't let that come to pass what she just prayed. What does, how will God do? Read. Not any of her vows or of her bonds wherewith she had bound her soul yeah. shall stand. Shall stand. Yeah. Meaning the father said, I don't like what she just said. Mm -hmm. That prayer is going to be blocked like Mutumbo. Ah, yeah. uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, not in my house. Fifth floor problem. Okay. Not in my house. <laughs> but watch this. What you miss is the husband portion. Mm. Read on. And the Lord shall forgive her because her father disallowed her. Her father disallowed it. Read. Verse 6. And if she had a at all an husband. Now she's married. Come on, let me show you what the power your mm. husband had when you was married. You never knew this. This is why it's important for a man, for a father to give his daughter to a man of understanding. Somebody who's going to apply the scriptures to her. Not beat her. Not, not teach like her with her hands. Though. Do none of that. But to apply God's commandments in the household. Read. And if she had at all an husband, mm -hmm. which she vowed, or mm -hmm. uttereth out, out, uh, out of her lips. Now, if her husband is home, and he hears her pray, read. Wherewith she bound her soul. Read. And her husband heard it, and he and he held his peace. Now, her husband her. heard what she prayed, Lord. Me and my husband, we need a house. We need this and we need that. I'm going to get a job. Help me get a job. He said, okay. The husband said, okay, I like that. That's cool. Read. And held his peace at her in the day that he heard it. He didn't, he didn't say nothing. He ain't disallow it. Go ahead. Then her vow shall stand. Mm. And her bonds wherewith she bound her soul shall stand. Read. But if her husband disallow now her. Now if her husband, the man that she chose, if he blocks it like Mutumbo, if he says, I don't want that to come to pass. Lord, don't let that come mm. to pass. Read. But if her husband wow. disallowed her on the day that he heard it. Wow. On the day that he heard it. That's then he. But if her husband disallowed her on the day that he heard it, wow. on the day he heard it, then he right. shall make her vow which she had vowed, and that which she uttered with her lips, what? Where which she bound her soul, what? Of none effect. Of what? Of none effect. Of what? Of none effect. It's mm, of wow. none. Her husband has the ability, the God given ability, to say, Lord, do not allow her prayer to go forth. Mm. That's why it's Dang. so that's important deep. for a that's woman to choose the right man. That's heavy. That's, that's my heavy. first time hearing that. That's part. heavy. That's heavy. Mm -hmm. We about that's to go to commercial. Hey, Big Keith. Big Keith. So we don't. We, she said it sound evil. Oh my Bible. goodness. We gonna go to commercial. We gonna hear from y'all, right? But we about to go to that commercial, right? So if you listening, we about to play some music from original royalty. As of right now, the topic. That was going on is beautiful. You know, when we come back, we're gonna play a video clip of a situation that happened in a marriage. And we're gonna hear from both parties. We're gonna hear from the men of God, mm -hmm. and we're gonna hear from our lovely sisters, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So uh but I do want to make this point before we close. I do agree that the black man in his community is important for us to be leaders. That's it's right. important for us to stand up and not look for sex first in women and actually be leaders so we can be those fathers. Because as the scriptures just said, the father is supposed to find a man. That's right. As a man myself who got who have a daughter, I know for a fact I can find a scoundrel mm -hmm. before she can because I used to be a scoundrel. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I used to be a scoundrel. I used to, I know all the tricks to the trade to get in the drawers. You know what I'm saying? So I can be able there when the dude comes, be there to block that. You feel what I'm saying? That's what we need, fathers in the community. Big keys. Bless the mic. Let's get into the bless the mic. We're, uh, all praise to the most high. We coming back. This is Signs of the Time brought to you by IUIC and Original Royalty.
Black Relationships episode. 88.1. Call in. Oh, yeah, yeah. Call in. 313-868-0331. Oh, I pray. Five, four, three, two, one. So you just rebellious. Yes, that's why I had to work for myself. That's the and is that why you gave up a good man? Oh, okay, how you gonna listen to a woman that ain't got a man? Right. How to get right. a man? Right. Yes. I'm not a man. job, but I'm Hold saying, on, sis. Hold on. We talking to the man. The man ain't matter. The man ain't right. matter. It don't matter in marriage because you're doing that. People are doing that now. I totally agree. I'm so happy to submit to my husband. Can you withhold Poo Nanny from your hood? Somebody said that sounds like slavery. Are you a slave? No, I am not a slave. Oh, what not. are you talking about? What the hell is this? Okay. The hell? Turn me up. Breathe. Okay. Do we provide for you? Yes. That way y'all's going to You can't to even submit right now. So right. it's daytime. Uh, what is a nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. 